Instructions for TrendGuard Dynamic Patient Support Frame. Select the appropriate TrendGuard procedure pack prior to installation. Inspect the TrendGuard components before use and confirm the frame and clamps are in good working order. First, install the clamps. Make sure they are fully open before snapping onto the rail. Dynamic frame mounting posts are width adjustable to fit a variety of tables. Insert the posts into the clamps to install the frame on the table. The clamps allow dynamic adjustment of the frame along the length of the table. Ensure the frame is centered across the table and refer to the label for proper orientation. Attach the cervical notch bolster to the frame. The curved portion of the bolster extends over the frame by a finger's width. Press on the bolster to make a full connection to the frame. Position the frame and bolster. Lift the patient's head and slide the frame towards the patient. The bolster should be snug against the patient's trapezius muscle. Confirm that the leading edge of the curve is nestled against the trapezius. Securely tighten both rail clamps and lock the posts in place. Turn the black levers inward to lock the angle of the mounting posts. Install the head stabilizing pillow and take care to avoid contact with the patient's ears. To install lateral stabilizing pillows, lift the patient's shoulder and position the pillow, leaving a gap of about a hand's thickness between the pillow and the patient's shoulder. These pillows do not support the patient, they simply control body mass shift. Double check the clamps and the locking levers. Always perform the tip test prior to draping by bringing the table to the full operative degree of Trendelenburg. Always read and understand instructions for use before using TrendGuard. The TrendGuard dynamic frame makes repositioning easier when patients are on a wide range of underbody devices. Here's how it works with air-assisted transfer. The TrendGuard frame should be on the top of the underbody device. Loosen clamps and unlock black levers before inflating the device. The dynamic frame moves freely and glides along effortlessly with the patient during repositioning. When the patient is in position and the transfer device is deflated, Lock the black levers, fully tighten clamps, and while not shown here, perform the standard tip test to ensure patient stability. After the procedure is completed, remove the dynamic frame by simply slipping it out from under the patient. With TrendGuard, positioning and repositioning patients for Trendelenburg procedures is safer for patients and staff. For more information, visit our website or call 800-261-9953.